Well, welcome everyone. Welcome to Daily Trinity of Pinax News. Now, it's been a very long time we get, I mean, we got interactive with all of you. Yes, I know. Uh, but finally, the door or the way has been opened and we officially welcome all of you to Daily Trinity of Pinax News. Here on the platform, we talk everything entertainment. So if you're new to this channel, all you have to do is to just hop onto our social network, that's our YouTube. Just subscribe, get interactive with us. Let's get interactive. Now, um, it's also a brand new uh, month. We're in the month of May and of course, new energy, new positivity. However, one interesting figure seems to be always being repetitive when it comes to a, a certain tag on her. And who are we talking about? The none other than Miss you know, Jay, uh, she likes to call herself, uh, is it Miss S or Miss J? Well, her name is Chantel Jackson. Now, we all do know that Nelly and Ashanti have officially outdoored, I mean, they're bouncing, well, it's not like officially they have given birth, but Ashanti officially has made it known that, she, yes, she's pregnant, and, uh, you know, she's made it publicly known, but I don't know what's happening with the camp of Chantel Jackson, and some fans have also been speculating that her recent post on her Instagram is, is I mean, is is is, is spirit in some interesting conversations on the internet, and some say that girl is not just completely done with Nelly. It looks like all the time Nelly is just appearing in his dreams, uh, sorry, her dreams, and she just cannot contain that. So we're going to go into that very shortly. But hey, let me remind you that you can also get interactive with us inside the comment section. Just Make it decorous, okay? Uh, let's get interactive. So, Chantel Jackson, like I did say, is back in the news. And um, now she says that she's not jealous about Nelly. She's not jealous of Ashanti. And let's put you a tweet she posted recently on your screens to see exactly why Chantel Jackson is back in the news again. Now, I don't, I don't, I don't see why this lady always keeps bringing things or conversations up for herself when she knows clearly that sub subliminals are, you know, that she put out there tries to uh, give a certain impression yet she continuously do it and at this point I, I don't want to defend Chantel Jackson for this I don't know what she was talking about but directly or indirectly it had a meaning this post suggestively has a meaning and Ashanti of course is is is, is more or less inside this conversation Nelly equally is in this conversation, okay? So this is the tweet she posted Miss J or Miss Jackson you see her over there she said now this is the first tweet she made not impressed. What competition? I am the best. Hashtag rich. Oh, let me just be careful. Rich, uh, rich titives, I guess that's what she means. And she says, I'm wearing this outside. Okay, so I think it was a top or something she was wearing. Of course, we all do know that Chantel Jackson is, in, is into shoes and the collections and all of that. So, I mean, impressed about, not impressed about what? Now, just beneath the comment section, a lady also came and responded and said that trying to send a subliminal message. Yes, you got it going on, girl, but Nelly is where he wants to be, with an exclamation mark over there. <laughs> Seriously, Chantel Jackson, like, honestly, I thought we were just done with this conversation a long time ago. Like, I thought this history of being, you know, jabbing here and there was, was a thing of the past, but all the time she, I don't know, but okay, let's, let's just do away with this conversation, I mean, this particular tweet, and move on to a different tweet that she made. Now, Pay attention to this one again. She says, forgive yourself for not knowing what you know. Okay, forgive yourself for not knowing what you know now. Help me understand this. Guys, like, drop your comment inside the comment section. What really is Chantel Jackson talking about with this second post she made? She said, forgive yourself for not knowing what you know now. What don't we know? I mean, she has to... She, see, I hate the one people indirectly want to confront you like they, they directly want to confront you but they find it a very shady way like um they they they, they, they find ways and means it through subliminals or so through tantrums here and then just be shading in fact go directly to Shintel Jack uh, ashanti talk to her directly mention her name call it out but this has become so repetitive like since 2022 all through to 2024 girl is still shading nelly and ashanti and Seriously, girl, I don't, I, don't, I don't like this energy at all. It doesn't speak well of you. It's like you're still living in the shadows of Nelly and Ashanti. Like, <laughs> it's like they, they're haunting you. What is wrong with this girl? I love her so much. Like, I like how passionate she is about her work or how dedicated and committed she is when it comes to uh, marketing her stuff. But this one, girl, what's happening? Girls, help me. I mean help me inside the comment section okay she says she's not jealous 
and we do not know what we're talking about now because I probably think that she knows more. Of course, she knows more than we do. Anyways, that's Chantel Jackson, the latest update we have for you. We'll get in more into that later. But quickly, let's go to some interesting conversations, of course, uh, that popped up after Chantel Jackson made this rather, I should say, um, unreasonable comments uh, or posts, I should say, because, of course, we already know where she is targeting. But unfortunately, she was not bold enough to mention uh, the name of Ashanti. So, mm, this lady comes to say, I don't know if it's a she or he, uh, she says that, uh, she would ask, what do you know now? Exactly, Chantel. What don't we know that you know? I'm so desperately wanting to know what we, we don't know that you know. That the baby is not for Ashanti. That Chantel you telling us that Nelly is not responsible for, I mean, what's happening? Are you not done with Nelly already? Anyway, let's move on to a different comment. And this one comes to say, I has always loved her. They were just at different places in their lives. At that moment, you came along and filled that void. But only uh, for the moment, she feeds, uh, okay, I, I guess you want to say she feeds her soul. And he feeds her soul. Their families are blended. His children could never fully get into you because it was always here for them. Move on in peace and heal. You see, at this point, Chantel Jackson, you see what I'm talking about? It's like <laughs> people are saying that you're still not done with Nelly yet and you still are desperately wanting to get him back. I don't know. But of course, like people have been saying, that is what you think. Um, about that also. Now, Rose Petals comes to say that, girl, every time uh, uh, he lost his... Okay, well, I don't want to repeat that thing any, on, on this particular platform. Guys, let's be decorous over here, okay? So, yeah, uh, that's Chantel Jackson over there uh, throwing tantrums as usual to uh, the camp of Nelly and Ashanti. The first post, she says that, um, you know, uh, she's not, um, you know, not impressed. And she also goes on to say that what competition, what competition? Like people will be saying that she has a competition with Ashanti and that she's copying the style of Ashanti, uh, that she has been dressing like Ashanti, where everything more like dress and be like the, uh, the other version of Ashanti. I don't know if I should call her a clone, or I don't know, but that's what some people have been saying. And now she says that she's not in any competition with Ashanti. Neither is she, is she impressed with anything that has to do with Nelly and Ashanti. Now the next post, she comes out and says that, forgive yourself for not knowing what you know now. And that's making everyone think in, 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 in limbo. In fact, myself, I'm in limbo. Like, what actually does... Chantel Jackson know that we do not know? That's a big question. And what, why is she saying that she's not impressed and that she's not in a competition? I agree. We don't have to be in a competition. I mean, life is not a competition. Life is not a competition. You live within your means. You just have to accept that this is you and you just have to know how to carry yourself. But how she has been going about things, I feel she feels like she, she's, she's in a competition with Ashanti. And I feel at this point, girl, you're losing this battle, Okay. So guys, let's know what you think about it. It's a brand new month, of course. Leave your thought and comment inside the comment section. This hasn't been changed up in Axe News. Thanks for watching.